Hello everyone, it is Krebs Kabu here and I'm going to be teaching you guys how to fix this error that I have had myself. It is an invisible character and most particularly a lot of people are getting this at the moment now that the 1.7.1 patch has been released. I have a feeling that this is probably going to apply to future patches. So if you are a future visitor, then it's going to probably apply to your patch. And this is how I have managed to get it to work and along with a few of my other friends, okay? So basically what you'll notice in this latest patch is that when you ever you spawn on a server, you'll basically be invisible and yeah, that's pretty much it. It's invisible, you can't see anything apart from the terrain. Now how you, do you get that fixed? Well, it's most likely a issue with your installation files, whether that's with DayZ or your actual game itself. We're gonna get that uh, remedied and fixed up. So the first thing that you're going to want to need, and the first and only thing that you're going to need, is this tool over here. It is the 6 Updater. I'll link you guys this in the description box below, but otherwise it's daisymod.com slash su.php. That is the 6 Updater suite that you're going to want. And once you've installed it, what it will look like is something like this. This is, by the way, there's uh, two programs that it comes with. If we head on over to six projects, what you'll see is the launcher and the updater. What you want to start is the updater. And you get this. It looks a bit confusing, but no, it's not. All you have to do is head on over to mods, click that, and a list of a whole bunch of different things is going to come up. And what you're going to want to do is locate at daisy. It's all alphabetical. And what you'll find is this. Now, over on your status, you might get something completely different. It might be something red. I'm not exactly sure what it will look like. But what you want to do is right click on it and head on over to the updater actions down to install or update mods. Okay. And once you do that, you should get some things that begin downloading. It might be uh, at day Z that comes up first. I had to actually do this twice. I had to actually go to this. Um, uh, update mods thing twice because the first time it only brung up at day Z second time it brought up this expansion slash beta so uh, get make sure you do it enough times until you get this and make sure they are downloaded uh, what I had to do then when I started up the game it still didn't work all I had to do to finally get it working I know so many steps say eh? what I had to do is just go to simply update our actions and just launch the game from here and then every time after that you can just launch the game normally I'm not exactly sure if that step is needed I just found that it worked for me so hopefully those steps will work for you and if you're looking for a text guide I will include one in the description box below Hope you guys enjoyed this and hope this helps. And of course, I will see you on the Daisy Battlefield to kill some zombies. Until next time, catch you all later.